Today's video is brought to you by eWin Racing, the best source for gaming chairs and desks for those long gaming sessions. We have a playlist of our eWin chair and desk videos linked in the video description below. Save 30% off of everything using the discount code TECHDEALS. More details at the end of the video. Why do people have multiple PCs? I have a gaming PC and a home theater PC. What else is there? And he also says that Unity is a bit easier and is easy to make cross-platform games. Well, why, why do you think people would have multiple PCs? You mean sitting on the corner on a shelf? Who has to anyway? <laughs> <laughs> so while you think about that, I'll give an answer. Okay. The do. average person doesn't need multiple personal desktop PCs but I can think of a couple of reasons why you might. If you are a live streamer and you are a serious professional yeah. live streamer, two computers, one for streaming, one for actually playing games makes a lot of sense for different reasons, but you're gonna be a pretty big streamer before that makes sense, otherwise just use one. Content creators who want to yes. let processes run for a while, perhaps you have a 3D animation you wanna run, perhaps you're an artist and you've got a renders or effects going on. Having those happen on a second PC means there's no resources on your main PC being used. Yes, and they can take up a lot of resources. A lot of RAM, your yep. GPU, your yep. CPU. They can slow what you're doing down. So somebody who makes money with their PC may want an extra to yep. just do extra processes. You say, so you do like your, your editing of something in Blender here. And then render And then it. offload the project to another machine. Um, sometimes people want to keep older PCs around for hobbyist reasons. Yep. Perhaps you want to keep a Windows XP around, a Windows XP machine or a Vista or Seven machine. Not that you need it per se. A lot of that stuff will run on a modern PC, but people enjoy these things. Finesse some, pe sure. some people keep DOS machines around. They now do. that's sort of a different category. I don't think that's what Tiger meant, but a 486DX266 for playing DOS games mm -hmm. on bare metal hardware as opposed well, to you've emulation. Got Apple 2G, so. That is true laptops for on the go you have a nice desktop yep now you need a laptop yep. a home theater pc might be separate that's three yep how about a spare backup pc you use a computer for five years you build a new one you take the old one you set it aside so you have an extra one if something happens for whatever reason your main pc uh winters says he's got a second pc for hosting game servers so yeah if you're hosting game servers a virtual machine that would be good to have a separate machine. Ewin Racing has a wide selection of chairs to fit all shapes and sizes of gamers, ranging from petite to cuddly. They have something for every type of gamer. Not just sizes, but colors and material options as well, including red, blue, purple, pink, orange, and more, plus cloth and leather choices. We have over half a dozen chair and desk videos in a playlist down in the video description below. We also have a very special offer just for Tech Deals viewers. Save 30% off of everything using discount code tech deals using our link in the video description. We have used eWin gaming chairs for three years in our office, sitting on them for up to eight hour marathon live streams. They are very comfortable and we are happy to work with eWin to bring you this special discount and recommend eWin for all of your gaming chair and desk needs.